Hi guys, I'm Andy. Welcome back to Backpacking UK. Hiking, backpacking and wild camping your thing. Please hit that subscribe button because that's what this channel's all about. Right, so I'm on my way to Scotland, but I thought it'd be rude not to pop into Keswick in the Lake District to take on Skiddor on my own. Skiddorse, the sixth largest mountain in England at 931 metres. Hopefully I'm going to get some good summit shots today. So I've got like Keswick in the background there and then behind me I've got the like Blencathra sort of range there. So it's perfect. This is August but it's not that warm, but it's perfect hiking temperatures. So, the first hard bit's just about to start here. Winding my way up here, but I oh, can't wait. So good being back in the Lake District. So blood's been pumping straight up out of Keswick, but you don't feel it because the views are just out of this world. They really, really are. So I'm going to try and get up li Little Man before it starts raining because it is the Lake District and it is always raining. So do that and then make my way to Skiddor. Some little friends on the summit of Skiddor. Whoa, a bit breezy up here. Oh, blowing a gale. And it is five degrees at most. Judging by my fingers, I'd say two or three degrees. So, gosh, this is August. <laughs> What's it like in winter? Flipping it must be about minus 20 in winter. Right, so here we are. This is the summit of Skiddor. Skiddor, man. 931 metres, the sixth highest mountain in England. And I can't see anything. <laughs> It's always the way with me, whenever I hit a summit, I rarely get a decent shot. So I'm going to work my way down now. I've got another couple of Wainwrights that I want to bag before I go back into Keswick. Just been uh, walking in the clouds, nothing to see. And then finally, a little glimmer of a valley. Right, so the cloud is just broken. So I can show you where I'm off to next, which is Lon Scale Fell, 715 metres. Oh, spot above rear. Oh God, three, two, one. <coughs> oh God, look at that. Should have been a long jumper. So that's Lon Scale Fell bagged. You can see the remaining northern fells in the background. It's just lovely round here. It's, you know, it just makes you realise how important it is having access land and the right to roam. I know it's farmland, but God, the benefits it brings to people is... Uh, just brilliant, you know, for your physical and mental health. Uh, it's just lovely up here. And to be honest, it doesn't really matter too much what the weather's like. It's, it's just stunning. It really, really is.
Oh, look at those moody looking clouds. So the ascent that I did earlier looks quite impressive from this angle. Right, time to uh, test the La Sportiva boots out. It's going to be a bit interesting. These uh, lightweight boots aren't known for being fully waterproof. So now's the time to to see. I'm not going to dunk them on purpose, but it's just lovely round here. There you go, job done. So that's Latrig done. That is 368 metres. I actually seen more people up there than the whole of my Skiddle walk. And it's just really, really popular. It's lots of families, it's great to see. Um, I'd highly recommend that. It's a, it's a proper, proper little mini mountain that is. It's, it's really good. So this brings me to an end of my hiking Skiddor route. Done about 10 miles. By the time I get back to the car, it'll be about 11. I'll put the route in the description. So feel free to check that out. But I've absolutely loved it. Really, really enjoyed being back in the Lake District. I'm gonna head into Keswick to get myself a pint of Wainwright before I go on to my next destination. But the gear that I was using today has been really good. That Sherpa jacket of mine, the green waterproof, I'll put the links in the description. That is superb jacket that is. Um, it really is. I was really surprised by my La Sportiva uh, boots. Despite being lightweight, they're actually really comfy and they were waterproof as well. And the Revolution Race uh, trousers, this year they've been the perfect choice because we haven't really had a summer yet and it's August. But hopefully you like this video. Please check out my other hiking videos too. Got plenty out there, but I hope to see you hiking soon. Cheers.